Hello all, welcome to Selenium Python training series. In this session, as part of PyTest, I am going to explain what is a fixture in PyTest or what are fixtures in PyTest. So let's get started. In PyTest, we can run some test methods, right? That uh, I have already shown and demonstrated in the previous sessions, how to run the PyTest test, I've already covered in the previous sessions. But here is something about fixtures that you need to understand and how they are related to this PyTest test. For example, without fixtures, what will happen here is in PyTest, you can create some tests. Let's say test one, assume that this is one of the test method, test two, like that any number of test, uh, test methods you can create and you can run them with the help of PyTest. With the help of PyTest commands, we can run this test and this test will run for sure. But what if before running this test one and test two, uh, kind of code and write, you want to run some setup code. Okay, if you take an example of Selenium automation, uh, before running this particular test, let's say login with valid credentials. Let's say this is login with valid credentials, login with uh, valid credentials test. Before running this uh, code related to this login with valid credential test, you have to run some setup code for launching browser and for opening application app URL. Okay. After opening the browser and opening the application URL in the browser, then only you can perform this login with valid credentials code test. And after this is done, you, have, you need to run some closure code, okay, or tear down code, whatever you can call. Here, yeah, this is a predict side code which need to be run before the test runs, test code runs. And after the test code runs, you have to run some closure code where you are going to log out from the application and close the browser, close browser, okay. Here we are opening the browser and opening the application URL before this test code is executed. Once the browser is open and uh, application URL is open in the browser, then you are going to perform this particular test. And after the test is done, you are going to log out from the application and close the browser. Not only for this test, for this test also, for example, this is like a login with, uh, when I, for example, login with uh, valid uh, username and uh, invalid password. This is another test. Okay, this is another test. Before the code related to this particular test is run, we have to first launch the browser and open the application URL. And after the code for this particular test is done, we have to log it from the application and log it from the application and close the browser. For every test, we need to run this pre set code. And after every test is done, we have to run this closure code, right? So how to how to make sure that along with this test, how to make sure that this pre set code will run before the test methods and uh, this closure code will run after the tests are run? This is possible with the help of fixtures, okay? We can run this setup code before the test and uh, this closure code after the test with the help of this fixtures in PyTest. So how this is possible practically, I'm going to cover in this session. For that, I'll open this PyCharm ID and I will demonstrate all these things for you. Okay, how to run the setup code and tear down code before and after the each and every test in this PyTest with the help of fixtures, I'm going to cover, okay? So for now, uh, there is one sample Python file, test sample.py file under the sample package of this project. Here I'm going to create the same two test methods that I have given in this example, login with valid credentials and login with valid username and invalid password methods. Test methods I'm going to create test underscore login with valid credentials. This is one test. You can create any number of tests, credentials. Okay, this is one test. And uh, here I'll not write the real Selenium code, but uh, I'll just write some print statement representing that code running. Uh, the uh, code related to our uh, testing, test login, login, wait, valid credentials, okay? That uh, if this print statement is uh, printed means this particular test method is getting executed, okay? Now, similarly, one more test method I'll create. So test login with valid credentials, okay? And uh, here one more test method, test login with with a valid email and invalid password. This is another test method. Print, print, testing, test login with, test uh, login with uh, valid email and invalid password. Another test got as you, okay? If, if another test got executed, this print statement will be printed. So I can run these two tests without any problem, right? Without any setup code and uh, tear down or closure code, we can directly run the test. 
but in real time this is not the case so here i'll simply say clear and uh, under this project under the package we have this uh, python file under which we have this uh, two tests which we can run with the help of pytest how to run simply say pytest hyphen vs okay pytest hyphen vs and uh, followed by you can give the package name under which this uh, python file is available that is a uh, sample sample package backward slash and give the name of the python file under which uh, two test methods are available for sample press enter and you can see two tests got passed so you can see the output coming here when these two test methods got executed test testing test login with valid credentials got printed and testing test login with valid email and invalid password but for every test here before every test runs i have to run some setup code right in selenium automation or whatever it is first i have to launch the browser then open the application url for that i'll create one method that is test i'll just name this method as setup you can name it anything set up prefix site or whatever you can write here i'll write on print launch browser now print launch uh, i mean open application open application url application url in browser like this two steps this setup code need to run before every test method for every test method before every test method runs the setup code need to run for that i have to mark this setup method with a fixture how to mark that at the rate i test dot i have to say fixture and give the circular brackets now hover the mouse on the at the rate i test and import this i test here okay now this has been this particular method has been converted into a fixture which need to run before every test method but it's not going to run so what you have to do here is the name of the fixture method you have to provide here in the circular brackets of this test methods for example setup right the setup is the name of the method this name we have to provide here then only this setup fixture is going to this code is going to run before every test method runs okay now let us run this and see what kind of output we are getting i test type and vs sample package backward slash test underscore sample dot py and press enter you see before every test method the fixture code has been executed the setup code has been executed that is open launch browser open application url in the browser after that test login with valid credentials then for the second test method also again browser got launched the setup method got uh, fixture method got executed open application url in the browser and testing test login with valid email and invalid password now what about the closure code after these two test methods for after every test method got executed you need to run some closure code where which will log out from the application and close the browser so here if i write this uh, print log out from application log out from application and print close close browser if i write like this this code will run before this test methods so what i have to do see this code need to run after the test method but here because this all these four lines belong to the same setup method these four lines will run before every test method that's not right you can see that here again i'll go to clear and uh, run the command pytest uh, iphone vs uh, in the package package uh, that is sample package name of the package is sample package backward slash test underscore sample file dot uh, sorry sample dot py right sample dot py and press enter you see that all these four lines in the setup method will run before every test method that's right that's not right launching the browser opening the application url the closure code is also running before the test method after closing the browser the test is getting executed that's not correct here also launch browser open application url log out and close the browser then only the test is getting executed that's not right i want these two lines to run after the test methods after the test method code uh, code get executed how to do that so in this method here i'll write down here i'll write down after these two lines i'll provide a keyword known as yield keyword okay this yield keyword will separate the setup code from the tear down code now this method this fixture method has not only the setup code but also setup point tear down i'll see okay i'll copy this name and paste that in this uh, test methods like this setup point tear down 
with help of yield keyword we are separating the setup code from the tier down code now first it will launch the browser then open the application url in the browser the test will be performed after that it will log out from the application and close the browser the second test also same thing will happen first it will launch the browser open the application url then the test will be performed and after that it will log out from the application and close the browser okay with the help of yield keyword we can separate the setup code from the tier down code now run the code clear now say pytest hyphen vs under this package known as sample package we have that uh, tester sample dot by file you can see now the setup code then test then tear down code will run launch browser open the application url setup code is done after that the test is getting run testing test login with valid credentials and after that log out from the application and close the browser the tear down code is running after the test with the help of yield keyword this is possible okay here also launch browser open the application you are in the browser that the test, test code got executed after that the closer code like log out from the application and close browser this is what is expected so with the help of fixtures we can run the setup code before the test methods test methods run and uh, tear down code after the test methods run this is what is the purpose of the fixtures and this is how we have to use fixtures in pytest okay fixtures will help us in creating this setup code and tear down code which can be run before setup code which can be run before the test runs and tear down code which can be run after the test runs okay with the help of yield keyword we can separate the setup code from the tear down code and uh, and we have to specify the name of the fixture in the test methods if you don't specify this will not work okay if if you don't specify before this test method and after the test method this code is not going to run okay you can see that here for one of the test method i have removed this uh, mentioning of this uh, fixture name fixture method name in the test method only for this uh, first test method it is there for the second test method it is not there okay only for the first test method setup and tear down code will run before and after the code get executed and but for the second test method it's not going to happen go to the terminal clear it out write down py py test hyphen vs under this package known as a sample package backward slash under this file sample test sample dot py file press enter only for one test method the setup and tear code uh, setup and tear, uh, tear down code will run you see uh, for the first test method first launch browser is happening opening the application url in the browser and test method is test is getting executed that is login with valid credentials after that log out and tear down code that is log out from application close browser for the second test method you see there is no setup code running launch browser is not happening Ap open application url in the browser is not closure code is also not coming log out from application close browser is not happening only this direct print statement of the second test got run okay that's the reason if you want the setup code and tear down code for every test method, you have to mention this name of the fixture in the method. Okay, like this. Then only it will work. Otherwise, it's not going to work. Let me try it again. This time it will come. Py test hyphen vs py test hyphen vs sample package backward slash test underscore sample dot py press enter. You see, for every test method, setup and tear down code has run. Okay. So hope guys you understood what exactly is the fixture in PyTest or what exactly are fixtures in PyTest. So that's all for this session. See you in the next session. Thank you. Bye-bye.